When approaching a story problem, you want to start off by defining your variables. And as we read through this, some of the things that come up are length, area, perimeter, and width. Of these items, there are three of them that we don't know because it tells me that the area is 196. So ultimately, we have three things we don't know, which is going to tell us that we want to build three equations. Now let me go ahead and highlight a couple of the sentences or fragments here. So starting with this one, the length is four times the width, which is the same thing as L for length, the word is means equals, four times width, four next to W is four times W. Okay, then we continue reading and it just says the area of a rectangle. So we're gonna jot down the generic equation for the area of a rectangle, A equals LW, and then continues on and says the perimeter. So I'm gonna jot down the generic equation for the perimeter of a rectangle. Again, we don't know length, perimeter, and width. So if there are three things we don't know, we're gonna end up creating three equations. Okay, now that we have our three equations, we're going to start to solve. So let's make some substitutions, keeping in mind that the equation needs to contain all of the same variable, like all L's, all W's, all A's. And when I take a look at this area equation, I could replace the A with the 196, and I could replace the L with 4W. So 196 equals, and instead of L, I'm gonna put in that 4W, bring down this W. This equation only has W's in it, so I can solve this one. Four multiplied by W multiplied by W is 4W squared. To finish solving this equation, you're undoing the order of operations, so I wanna get rid of multiplication before I worry about exponents. Dividing both sides by four, I get 49. And then to undo squaring, I'm gonna take the square root. When I square root both sides, I get seven. Normally when you square root both sides, you get both positive and negative seven, but because this is a story problem, width is a distance, it can only be positive, so I just have positive seven. Now that I know the width, I can come over here and replace the width with seven. So I'm going to have my L equals four W, and then let's replace the width with seven, and four multiplied by seven is 28. So the length is 28. I now know the width and I know the length, so I could find the perimeter. I'm gonna come in and replace the length with 28 and the width with seven. So let's make those substitutions. We're just simplifying the right side, so we're following PEMDAS. So I'm gonna take two times 28 and two times seven. So the P is going to equal 56 plus 14. 56 and 14 makes 70. So we now know that the length is 28. We know the width is, oops, fix that really quick, sorry. The width is seven and the perimeter is 70.